What's going on YouTube? Right now, I'm on the way to Copart. Uh, just woke up from this nap. Sorry if I look a little tired, but um, right now I'm going for my first time ever to Copart. And I just want to do kind of a walk around because I keep seeing videos about Copart and I've been interested in the hype. I want to go check it out, do a walkthrough and see what kind of treasure we can find. So um, if you haven't already, subscribe below. Turn post, notifica post notifications on. Turn post, notifica post notifications on. Let's get this thing started. It's my first time ever being at Copart. Kind of nervous, kind of excited. We'll see. <laughs> Made it to the lot. I'm wearing my uh, yellow vest right now. It was pretty cool. Uh, it's, they were pretty nice in there. It was a simple process. I just had to show them my member number after I registered online, uh, which takes like two minutes. Give them the driver's license, sign out, grab a vest, and you're out of here. It's real simple. So right now I'm just going to preview some of the cars and see what we can find find my first hellcat jeez look at that whole engine's been pulled out of there looks like it had that front end damage all of that right there it's crazy back of it doesn't look bad at all though they put all the parts in the front right here dang that's crazy uh you gotta be careful man when you're riding with this much power those 707 horses would do you, I'm telling you. Looks like they threw everything in the back too. Interior looks pretty pristine still. Look at that. Oh wow. Look at that scat pack. Looks like the whole uh, rim fell off the wheel there. It's got front damage to the front. Maybe some uh, undercarriage damage as well. Ah, it's only got 15,000 miles on it. Jeez. Beauty right there. Little Cadillac right here. Got a little front impact. Try to take a look at the inside of this thing. Oh, looks like the uh, airbag definitely deployed. Uh, it's crazy. GMC right here. Look like it tore it up from the front. Ah, uh, that. That's crazy. It's a lot of. That's a lot of damage at the front. Airbag is deployed too. back of it looks intact pretty good too uh, this one probably it's probably seen its days probably seen the end of its days with that frame damage this little honda right here got that front end impact everything else looks good but this one my, my first biohazard i found it said bio blood 77,000 miles I'm sure the driver made it and everything. I already took a look in there. It's just a little bit of blood, but nothing crazy. Man, it's kind of crazy to see how many cars are out here, man. This is, this is kind of cool in a weird way to see all these cars. Even though it's not a car show, or they're not in, you know, their best condition, it's still something for me to see and experience. The Audi IS5, man, I've ridden one of these things. This thing is crazy fast, but I don't know what happened here. Front end of it just looks all screwed up, man. Whole front end is just torn out. Looks like, looks like to me he hit a pole just by the way it, it sits. Yeah, you can see that's probably where the pole right there was. Most likely it was a pole. You see the whole windshield shot out, man. That's crazy. I hope the driver made it out all right. Look at all that damages in there that's crazy holy sh goodness i hope driver came out all right look at that speedometers out of there the whole front end of the car looks like it just uh split in half almost uh this is one of the craziest ones i think i've seen so far jeez look at that man that's why i say you gotta drive carefully man i'm not gonna lie man the feeling i get being out here is kind of weird because you know, I've been in an accident before. I can tell you, it's it's a, it's a terrifying experience. And I kind of think, you know, what's the story behind each of these cars and the people that are in it and everything. And it just kind of makes me think a little bit. Got a little 3 Series right here. Interior looks pretty good. Got 160,000 miles on it. You know, this one says it's drivable. I don't know what could be wrong with it. Oh, found it. Side damage. It's like he got clipped from the side. 
probably rubbed against some kind of pole or something as you can see the trim coming off there found what i believe to be a 5.0 right here it's only got 18,000 miles on it oh, that's crazy it's locked i think it's got hit from the side from what i from what i see yep looks like that undercarriage has got damage too Looks like he hit something on this this uh, right side. Man, look at that G8. Ah, I love the G8 so much. <sighs> I don't know what happened here. Let's take a look. <sighs> front end of it. Oh man. Front of it, front end of it looks like the wheel is missing. It's just hanging off the side. Yep. Ah, oh, that's crazy. Look at that. You can't even see much from it. I wonder why they have these little bags around the uh, window. If anybody knows, leave your comments below. And this WRX looks like it got tore up. It's probably one. It's pro this one probably won't see any repairs done on it. Uh, look at that damage though. It's crazy. Man, this is my favorite car. Subaru ST. Uh, uh. Came across this little Benz truck here. It says it's drivable. Got the lot number. 92,000 miles doesn't have any damage from what i can see around it i just wish i could get more info from just looking at it but man this one's not bad i don't see any exterior damage whatsoever probably looking the inside inside looks pretty good too condition's good i mean the car is pretty clean from what i can see look at that. that's insane what's this Paint, paint marker for the windows. Ain't bad at all. I kind of like this classic little Jaguar here. It got a little front end damage, but this one's a donation. So you gotta remember about Copart, man. It's not all the cars are junk. I mean, some people just donate these in. Um, it's not bad. Take a look at the inside of it. Oh man, I can see myself pulling up in this. Thing is, I like about Jaguar the keys they got. Look at these keys. It's kind of got a, a unique taste to it. Man, the dash, wood grain dash. Inside of it looks real good, man. It's not bad. It's not bad at all. Cool. Man, I stumbled across this beautiful Audi, man. Look at that. You would never know anything's bad from the front until you go to the back. Oh, man. The back of it's kind of messed up. But that front front end look real nice i'm not gonna lie a5 back of it i saw this one online i forgot how much they want for it but man this one is terrific i wonder how much damage is on this thing looks like the frame yeah the frame right there was bent for sure it's crazy let's take a look at the inside oh man the inside's beautiful look at that dash everything on the inside's clean not a rip not a rip in the leather this one's nice man i stumbled across this motorcycle it looks like it came out of the movie ghost rider <laughs> thing is on fire it was on fire look at that it's crazy it kind of caught my eye it's got only sixty-eight thousand miles and it's got a clean title this is one i'll probably be looking at because with the clean title fixing up that front end damage i mean it's it's not a lot of damage but it's a little bit of damage something like this would be something that somebody would want to flip let me get a little closer to that damage front end right there missing the headlight and grill set but you know you got the reinforcement bar right here intact so it's not it's not the worst uh look take a look at the inside Not bad, little uh, six-speed manual. It's the M package too. It's not a bad car. Man, I was about to leave and I came across this Audi. Jesus, look at that nice Audi. This one has a uh, side damage to it. It looks beautiful to me. I don't care. A little bit of damage to the uh, nice headlight. Audi. Yeah, it is beautiful. Look at that carbon fiber uh, mirrors. It got damage to the side right there. Ah oh, man, I hate to see something like this go to waste. It's got that V8. 
Oh man, this one's beautiful. I was about to leave and this one popped out of nowhere. It's got that spoiler right there, carbon fibered out. Inside looking good. Everything on this thing. Side carbon fiber. Wish I could open it. I don't know if I can. I'm probably gonna have to ask that guy. He seemed nice. Come on, that Audi. beautiful you know me anytime i come around exotic like this i won't stop uh, paying attention to it i'll just be all over this thing well it's a beautiful car anyways guys i think it's time for me to head out of here i'm gonna make sure that the audi's behind me when i say my goodbyes but uh, if you haven't so already subscribe below uh quick shout out to that car addict armani couldn't come out here today but shout out to him i'm gonna leave his info below too uh it was a good time and i'll see y'all guys see y'all again subscribe below and peace out guys thank you